Good afternoon, Trev. Well, actually, good evening. We are at Disney Springs on a Sunday night, and we just had a fantastic dinner at Paradiso 37. So come along. Let's see what we have tonight at Paradiso. It may sound a little weird tonight, but we're gonna do the best we can with the noise and the sound and the music, but it is a happening place here tonight. Actually kind of exciting. It just rain, so everybody's yeah. like in the eat. Yeah, it, yeah, so it's gonna be exciting, but it, it's- It's gonna look awesome. And now Paradiso 37 stands for the 37 countries from the South America area down in that area. So we're gonna take a look at the menu and see what they have to offer us today. Travelers, it's already starting off great because I got a Coke. And looky here, we got an agave straw. Agave straw here at Paradiso 37. I will have to say the menu, is they've got a little bit of everything. Burgers, fish tacos, which I think I'm going to go with tonight. They got ribs. I mean, just all kinds of stuff. Appetizers. That crazy corn sounds good, but I think we're going to settle on the dipping, the P37, P37 dipping trio, and that comes with guacamole, P37 salsa, and queso cheese for $16. Okay, our appetizer just arrived, and we got the dipping trio. It comes with guacamole, P37 salsa and queso cheese dipping sauce for $16. And that is our appetizer tonight. I'm telling you guys, I absolutely love agave straws and they have them here. I have to tell them what agave is. It's from the plant bites, but they're actually better than paper. Okay, I am going to try something which I'm not a big fan of, but I'm going to go with a guacamole, guacamole, however you say it. Right there, the guacamole, oh man, look at that. So we're going to give this a try. My palate it must be getting better. The onions are really good in that. I hate to say that, but no, no, I don't hate to say that. That is really good guacamole. It's really good. Awesome. Really good. Awesome. Now I'm gonna try the cheese queso. That's it right there. It's already dripping off. It's not a thick cheese. It's a, more of a runny cheese, as you can tell. So we're going to give this a try. I like the cheese queso. The sauce is interesting. Is it? It's not hot. Okay. So the next one is the salsa. It's like... Ooh, it looks like it's got... Maybe a little smoky? I don't know. Yeah, it looks like it's roasted peppers and tomatoes. That's it right there. We're going to give it a try. That's my favorite. 
That's my favorite. That's my favorite. Okay, so Michelle's favorite is the guacamole. Mine is the salsa. Got a little heat to it, but not much. Not much at all. I didn't taste any at all. Okay, I, you know my palate, guys. Wow, that's funny. The cheese is good, but the smokiness of that tomato salsa is really good. Yeah, that's, but this is the size of the cup. And when they came to the table, they were plum full. If you guys can hear this, it'll be a miracle. But, I mean, this plum full. That's the cheese. So, for tonight's selection for Michelle's entree, she got the Honolulu pulled pork sandwich. It's a slow roasted pulled pork, grilled pineapple, coleslaw, and whiskey barbecue sauce. And that is $18. And I got, for my entree tonight, I got the Baja Fish Tacos, which come in flour tortillas, crispy battered seasonal white fish, corn salsa, shredded cabbage, and lime crema, and that is $20. Is that served with any sides or anything? Did we ask that? She asked me and she said something about it, but I can't She said it. everything's on the side, so we'll see if it comes with the side. Not quite sure at this moment, but we'll... You know we're gonna show you the food. Not a biggie. Okay, our food arrived like super quick, which is really nice. Michelle's entree did come with fries. Mine just came with the three fish tacos, but it looks like there's like a pound of fish on yeah. each of these tacos. I know, get us. Yeah, they are. Here, I'm gonna show them on here. Okay, this is just one taco. That but look, is crazy. Look at all that fish in there. I know, that looks so good. I know, that does. And what do you have on the side? I have coleslaw right there, a cilantro, no cilantro crema right there, and then one of my favorite things in the world, I might eat corn salsa. I love corn salsa, so this is perfect. So we're going to dig into these, we'll let you know how they are. Michelle gave me a little bite of her, what was it, uh, the pork? Honolulu pork sandwich. Right there. It does have a little bit of pineapple, but it's grilled, so that should be okay. We're going to give this a try. That sauce on there is fantastic. That is a great pork sandwich. Oh my gosh, this is really good. It's got that coleslaw on there. I can't wait till she tries it. What do you think? It's really sweet and tangy. It's, it's really not, good. Yeah, it's really good. It's really, good, really good. Tender. I know. That's a great sandwich, guys. Yeah, I'm surprised. It's really good. Okay, I built the taco right here. I've got a little bit of everything on there. And please excuse me while I bite this taco. No telling what's going to happen. So, let's give this a try. The cilantro crema with that coleslaw. The fish is nice and crispy. Very moist. This is a great fish taco. This is a great fish taco. Here, honey, try this. I'm gonna give Michelle a bite. I'm just gonna bite the top. And get you the go top. right ahead. Oh my gosh, this is oh. And we were not planning to come here tonight. We were actually headed to Maya Grill, but we found out they're only open Thursday, Friday, and Saturdays at the moment. So we we fought the people down here of Disney Springs. And it was well worth it. That's really this good. This is really good. The meal so far has been great. Oh, I'm going to go back to eating a little more I taco. I like the crunch of the coleslaw. Yeah. On it. It's really good. I'm going to eat a little more of this, and we'll be back with you guys. Travelers, we did learn when they bring you the appetizers with the chips and salsa. This is the little bag of chips right here. Right here. 
but if you run out of chips because there is so much dipping on the trio, they will bring you more chips. They will keep bringing you chips until you say stop. So that's good. But all in all, this food is. It was a good mistake. It's yeah. A this was there. a yeah. If you heard her, but you probably didn't because of the music. This was a good mistake. We went to one place, just rolled with the punches, fought the traffic to get in here, and here we are. So, fantastic meal so far. Okay, travelers, also don't forget to travel on down to the bottom of this video and hit that like button. If you have already subscribed, thank you so much for becoming a traveler. We are so, we so can, close to 500. We are so close to 500. I think we may get it now. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much for that. But don't forget to tell us where you're watching from so we can put your pin in the map. And if you are a new traveler to the channel and you have subscribed, also go down in the comments and let us know where you're from so we can also put you in the map. Travelers on these fish tacos, I didn't get a side with them, but there is so much fish on these tacos. I don't know if I'm going to be able to finish these tacos. Because of course, you know, we gotta get dessert. But they only do fry the fish. There's no grilled fish on these tacos. It's fried only, just to let you know. But there is a ton of fish on these tacos. Travelers, get out of my clothes. <laughs> Have you ever finished eating and said, oh man, I should have put some of that salsa on my fish tacos, but I finished my fish tacos. Didn't have no, nothing to put the salsa on. So I'm gonna get some more chips, continue to eat those. But that salsa would have been great on those fish tacos. Michelle recommended the cheese queso with the, with the um, queso salsa. over there. Salsa. So we're gonna try that. Queso is cheese. I should have eaten the whole thing like that. That is so good. It's so awesome. That is really good. I'm just happy this is a great meal. It's really good. So tonight's dessert selection, we're going to go with the Pacific Upside Down Cake. A warm caramelized pineapple cake with vanilla ice cream. And that's only $10. So we're gonna give that a try. And I might talk Michelle into the Florida Sunshine Orange Cake. And it's sweet Florida orange layered cake with white chocolate frosting. And that's $14. I think we're getting both of those. They both sound good. Yeah, so. The desserts just came to the table. And you know me, I get excited for those. The pineapple upside down dessert that we got looks really, really good. But that orange cake with the white chocolate looks incredible. Cannot wait to give these a try. Okay, the desserts. Here is the coconut, I mean the pineapple upside down. Right there, look at that. All the caramel on there and the ice cream. All that looks good. Uh, smells great. But this is the orange cake right here. Just look at all of that white chocolate right there. Oh. Yeah, that's it right there. That is fantastic. I get in trouble for holding the spoon on. Here it is, pineapple upside down. Oh, that is fantastic. Oh, that is so good. I think that's Michelle's dessert too. Oh my gosh, that is rough. Yes, this is mine. Yes. <laughs> I'm telling you what. Wow. Yeah, that cake is fantastic. So now we're going to try it's just like, um, a bite of the orange. It's just a, like a yellow cake, but like you would have pineapple upside yeah. down. But it's got a layer of pineapple and the ice cream. But that sauce that they put on it, it sounds, tastes like a butter rum caramel sauce, maybe. Another but, bite? Yeah, I'll take another bite. I ain't going to turn down a second bite. you got to be crazy. That is good. That is a fantastic cake. Now it's time to try the orange cake 
with the white chocolate vanilla frosting. Ah. That is fantastic. I love the pineapple. That's my favorite. really good. That tastes it. like a cream sickle. Like, it's so sweet. Oh, that is so good. I'm so happy to hear it. I'll be back in a second. Awesome, awesome. Right? It tastes like a cream sickle. That's exactly what it tastes like. It is cold, not like the warm coconut. I mean, the pineapple. That is a great cake, also. So, which one do you prefer of the two? The pineapple. She that likes really good. Oh yeah. It tastes like orange. It has a orange cream filling, and then it's got the white chocolate frosting. Yeah. Which is good. It's refreshing. It's citrus. But that. Yeah. I just I'm in love with these. Yeah. Like I can't really find one I don't like anywhere on property. <laughs> It's a pineapple, caramel, and ice cream. I'm on it. Yeah. Michelle can find desserts that she doesn't care for. I, on the other hand, will eat just about anything. If it's got sugar in it, that's there. But I love the orange cake, and I love the pineapple just the same. Now, not Michelle. She's got a definite winner. I will have to say, on the orange cake, I do believe it'd be much better at room temperature to get that icing a little more room temperature. But this pineapple upside down is fantastic. It has a, the sauce is sour. I think it's like different. a butter rum. Yeah, it tastes like a butter rum lifesaver. I'm gonna say that that might be one of the best desserts I've had recently. It is that good. It, it rivals the bread puddings. Yeah. You know what? Most people do drink crawls. We need to do like a dessert, a dessert? crawl. <laughs> Don't tell us. Keep that secret. We'll do a dessert crawl one day. Travelers, I just didn't want to let you know that they do do, they do do, they do pass holder discounts, BBC discounts, Table in Wonderland discount, and cast member discounts here at Paradiso 37. So remember to always ask. By the way, when they bring you your check with your discount, they do not add it to your check. So make sure you tip properly. Travelers, tonight meal, tonight's meal could not have been any better. We had a fantastic time. Disney Springs is hopping. Paradiso 37 is a very vibrant, exciting atmosphere. The food was fantastic. Everything, the service was fantastic. Our, serv our server was spot on tonight. All in all, every, I cannot say anything negative about Paradise here 37 tonight. It was a fantastic meal. And travelers, like we always say, until next time, travel and adventure is out there.